Hey everybody, it's Ria here, Ria on the run. And I'm just stopping real quick to share a quick Gaia's message. And the root and the base of all messages, guys, is alignment to the heart. You all know that, we all know that, but as we hear it um, described, expressed differently, we then are able to click onto a different point of reference, a different uh, point of uh, resonancy within us. So we're energy and we're vibration, as you all know. Like the sun here, guys, Gaia represents every little bit of our perfect alignment. The sun represents the sun within us, the light within us, the pure love and light, God's source guidance within us, the light that we are. The ocean here, guys, represents entering the flow of who we are, going with it, trusting with it, going through the ebbs, the flows, the, the stagnancy, the inrush, the tides. The sand here represents grounding that energy to Mother Earth and the manifestation. The sand represents us anchoring that energy, manifesting that energy. And what I want to bring up today is the more congruent and alignment you are to your divine frequency, which is nothing less than your pure heart, your heart, the energy of your heart, that will show outside of you in a more direct mirror of your true self through relationships, as you know, through state of being, through numbers, through opportunities, places you live, places you live, guys. So the point I wanna make here is I was having a conversation with a girlfriend, Alabama, and she was talking about how she used to weigh less and she's like 200 pounds, okay? She's 200 pounds of pure beauty. And I'm like, you don't wanna weigh that, you're perfect. And you know why she's perfect like that? It's because it's, res it's um, reflecting her truer vibration. It's not the number, guys, it's how you wear it. It's not how old you are, it's how you wear it. It's not how much you weigh, or the clothes you wear, or the thing you drive, or where you exercise, it's how you wear it. And if it's in alignment to who you are, the mass conscious paradigms, beliefs, definitions, labels of numbers, places, situations, things, relationships, how-tos, all that shit goes out the window. Because when you align to the truth of who you are, and your physical reality, like the sand, you're anchoring that into earth. That's all that matters, because what happens is then you enter that no time zone too, guys. You guys all know that zone where you feel unlimited, unbounded, um, like time is non-existent. It could be in that thing that you're passionate about, because that thing you're passionate about is in total alignment. And when you're in those moments, you don't feel your age, you don't feel your weight, you don't feel numbers. None of the mass paradigm, mass conscious definitions even apply to you guys because you are in alignment to this. Oh, where is it? <laughs> All right, the purity of who you are and your divine truth and your relationships and your situations will reflect that because as you're in alignment to who you are, your relationships will be more beautiful, more intimate, more um, in alignment to you, more expressive, more true. Your job isn't a job. It's a state and way of being. The number on the scale goes out the window because you feel good. Whether it be high, low, in between, it doesn't matter. It matters how you wear it, son of a bee. It matters how you are emitting your vibration. And that's exactly what we're going through, guys. Good morning, everybody. Forgive me if, if I don't um, really read you very good. Angel Bush, my birthday's coming up on the 12th. Happy birthday, Angel. Beautiful Kelly Abulita. Perfect message, share out, guys, because it ain't, not, <laughs> nothing matters on the outside world but being in alignment, and, and your alignment creates how you wear, wear the outside world, guys. And 2020 is that place of coming into that perfect balance, that foundation, that equilibrium, that balance, harmony, and peace, and alignment to who you are. It's not defined by the outside world. You freaking ass define it. You define your world. You wear your energy the best you can. What feels, and how do you know if you're wearing your energy and being that energy and vibrating? It feels good. It feels good. It feels like this. It feels like this. And as I have come into my greater alignment, it, it's no wonder I freaking live freaking in paradise. Because paradise is your natural state. It's your natural, heaven is your natural um, uh, place of 
living, residing, whatever heaven is to you. It doesn't matter. It just matters how you're freaking ass wearing it. It could be a, a one bedroom con condo in the Bronx. It could be a little shack or a little, uh, a little cabin in the woods or a little, uh, um, I can't think of it. Can be no, no. What is it called on the beach? The little huts, but you guys get the point. Doesn't matter. None of the labels, none of the definitions, none of the preconceived perception of the mass consciousness matters. Doesn't matter if you're 300 pounds, if you freaking ass feel good and you wear it well, freaking wear it, okay? If you are uh, got a relationship with someone 30 years difference, holy shit, don't take yourself outside the mind. Doesn't matter, it's it's how you wear it, how, how the alignments connect. And you guys gotta trust that connection. When you feel a connect, in any way, shape, or form of any sort of physical manifestation, know that that physical manifestation is the manifestation of your alignment. And you can choose it or not. It could let you know you're out of alignment, or it can let you know you are in perfect sync. So that's the message from Gaia today, guys. Good morning, Jenny. Good morning, Christina Harbaldi! Earth Keeper. We're all Earth Keepers, guys. We're all portals. We're all conduits to bringing that energy to Earth because we're the ones creating it through our being through our ownership through our oh my god this is just so beautiful just through our creative power guys you guys are all gods it's a time to totally break free from the limitations perceptions beliefs systems paradigms everything that has ever been created and as we create from the heart where the earth keepers creating a beautiful beautiful reflection just like this beautiful sun here guys just like just like the sun guys this is our true nature it shines it doesn't give a shit what we're doing down here it doesn't care what's flying by it doesn't care about what little hurricane or tsunami is passing through it just freaking shines and it focuses on itself when you're in that no time zone it's because you're totally focused with true intensity and unfiltered alignment to to your heart energy and that's what takes you to no time zone nothing else matters when you're in that zone guys nothing else matters when you're in click with that connection of whatever it is situation place things state of being relationship hobby art expression whatever that expression is for you it doesn't matter but when you take yourself out and then you compare and then you question and then you doubt that's when you enter um that whole linear time thing again guys so it's about having that intense focus to aligning to your heart and shining and illuminating and expressing it and that brings me to the gold room the gold room is all about that guys illuminating opening the treasure chest within you and letting it shine no matter what having that focus having that be your number one priority because that is where all else flows guys that is where all creation stems all right i wanted to make this short and snappy <laughs> and get back on my run guys may you all shine with the entirety of all the light that you are.